Hey everyone, Jen with Dinner Dispatch here. Wanted to come to you with a long overdue update. Um, we didn't do a video the past couple of weeks. Things have been, as you know, crazy. But today is a gorgeous day out here. Oh my gosh, my watch says it is 74 degrees, which is just fantastic. The sky is an amazing blue. Kids are running around. This um, We come down to this church parking lot uh, every day, rain or shine, so they can gather pokeballs. So I figured I'd do a quick video while they're doing that and get you updated. So um, today's Tuesday and as you know our orders are now due on Thursday so I'm filming this a couple days before our deadline um, but I will tell you that things are um, close to, I mean not sold out, um, but um, I guess pickings are getting slim you could say. Um, because of the supply chain situation and the scheduling situation, we have our um, set meal amounts now, which you know. Um, that continues to be our biggest challenge, I would say, is our food supply chain. So we have to order things earlier than we used to, and we have to make a call um, in advance on the quantities that we're going to get of any given ingredient and have to stick with it because it's all we have um, for that that order time. So um, that being said, we um, typically put up about 250-ish meals um, every go-round and um, as of now, with two days left before the deadline, we've sold about 200 out of the 250. So you guys are really getting the message about order early. That does mean that quite a few of the meals and sizes are completely sold out, um, but we do have plenty left of the um, some really delicious ones that I'm like, what is going on with these? Um, you know, these still having most of their quantity in there. Um, the beef and broccoli is another guest recipe from our friend Christine Lines at Spice Shack. It's delicious. Um, and we have some amazing comfort food, the tuna noodle casserole skillet meal. Um, I know tuna can be a love it or hate it situation. If you are a tuna lover, um, I highly recommend getting it. It is my kid's favorite. We had it um, last week while I was testing and tweaking it. We had it four days in a row. They devoured it every time and did not get sick of it. So highly recommend um, that skillet. And then I believe we still have quite a few left of the Jamaican jerk chicken thighs with um, sweet potatoes. Um, and a few left of the butter chicken. Um, this is all from memory. I'm not at my computer, obviously. So um, we do have Bob's prep, uh, Bob from Prep Kings. Um, his energy balls are back this week. So you can get um, mango coconut, which don't like, I don't know. If for some reason that doesn't sound good to you, get it anyway. Oh my gosh. It was last time he had me test those, it was. One of the most delicious things I'd ever eaten in my life. So I'm probably gonna get like eight of them <laughs> this time, <laughs> just because they're so good. And then, of course, he always has the regular monster cookie. Um, so again, with 50, about 50 meals left in our inventory, um, there's still plenty left if you jump on it. But of course, I do, th I do think we're gonna sell out. So I would not recommend waiting till the last second. Um, thank you so much. Thank you for supporting us. We are so honored to be here and help you through this time. We've gotten so much feedback from. Um, our wonderful customers <laughs> that um, these meals have always been a lifesaver and during these times they are even more of a lifesaver than they ever have been because of everything we're juggling while we're at home now we're not only trying to maintain our full-time jobs but we're trying to homeschool our kids and there is not a single second in the day for many of us who are still working those jobs to think about dinner time to make a trip to the store we're all not wanting to go to the store right so um, we are so honored to be able to fulfill that need for you right now and um, yeah so take care guys continue to stay safe stay well we are all in this together it's such a crazy time we'll never forget all right take care